who's got a good memory, remember a couple of years ago, we talked about dwarfed apples. I planted them in containers, and there they are. This one here is a delicious, and that's ready to use now. This one here is a Jonathan. I think they've got a magnificent, or that's a magnificent idea, to grow one of your dwarf fruit trees in a container. These here are now ready to uh, give me the fruit and then feed. And it's very important to realise that when you're growing anything in a container, the feeding of that is most important. If I don't and didn't feed these, they certainly wouldn't have produced the fruit that they've produced. This one here is a peach. I think we did have a, here's one, there's a peach there. Uh, this is the dwarf double pink peach. Magnificent when it's in flower, but also it produces a fruit. Now that has been in this container. I've repotted it a couple of times, but it's been in this container for something like four years and still quite a nice plant. Why don't you talk to your local nurserymen about some of these dwarf type fruit trees and give consideration to growing them into a container. They make a very good porch or veranda plant, very good uh, to grow under that uh, or that area that you haven't got a lot of room and you'll certainly get fruit within two years because there's the proof. Quite a good idea. Okay, we look forward to seeing you next week. Cheerio. Monday on ABC, it's the return of the classic comedy, Forty Towers. John Cleese stars as the bumbling Basil Forty in everyone's favourite comedy of errors. Followed by the humour of Yes Minister. Isaac Wolfson is only the second man in history to have had a college named after him since Oxford and Cambridge. Who no, was the first? Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Christ. <laughs> Comedy at its best, following the 7.30 reports, Monday on ABC.